Hey everyone, Alex here. And before I do say anything, I want to apologize to anyone that watches my videos that this isn't another Xenoverse 2 video or any gaming video in general. I know it's been a while since I last uploaded anything. Um, this video is just going to be talking about Roblox, or rather my side of the situation. Because about a month ago, I watched a video from Visual Ventures, and it's basically talking about how Roblox is corrupted and they don't care for people. I also read the comments on that video, and they have it's just people sharing their side or agreeing about how Roblox has just changed for the worse, which I also agree. I have went on a couple of Roblox clubs, like those dance clubs. Because I mostly, you know, I like spending my time in there. I like chilling with people. If they're fine with me, I'm fine with them. I don't mind. As long as you don't talk shit about me, which I'm pretty sure a few people do talk shit about me, fuck him. But as long as you don't do that, I won't do that. Not only are the game passes, like, trying to rip people off. I'm actually in a situation where a guy with a bunch of his friends... They like to harass my friend because, you know, obviously to silence her from telling people the truth about what's going on with them, or mainly the guy. And if you guys are wondering what that is, it's just more the fact that he is paying people off, mainly staffs and owners, to silence people that talks bad about him. And it's just upsetting that whenever I talk to these owners and staffs and I ask them, hey, can you show me evidence or can we talk about how you banned my friend without giving any proper reasoning, they just give me the silent treatment. It's upsetting that these most of these people are adults, by the way. And they don't want to tell me all of this because they know that they're in the wrong and they know that I'm going to actually, like, chew them out for it. We barely do anything. It's just the fact that people like following a specific person or a specific group because either they're afraid, they're blind, or they only care about their money, which explains why they start paying off the owners and the staffs. I just wanted to get this out of the way because I know there have been a lot of people that have dealt with situations like this and their stories have not been told yet, but I know they also want to share their side of the story. Apparently money talks now because of how the internet is and how people just want money. I know we all been hit by the pandemic, but like, you know, I didn't think money was this badly to the point in which the owners and servers start being so corrupted. Sadly, Roblox cares about money and they won't do anything to purge these servers because they just don't care. Oh, but, but it's petty drama and you're adding too much to it. And yet here I am trying to give my side and obviously either people will not listen or those guys will try to shut me up for it. Which won't happen. And money does talk, but money is temporary too. Please comment, like, and subscribe if you want. I appreciate it. Give the support. Share this out to anyone who does want to share their side in the comment section or give their thoughts on what they thought about what I said. This is Dereo by Alex11 and I sign out. See you guys.